What's up everybody? Coming in with another video today. Thought I'd start things off with a little bit of cleaning because this gym is getting disgusting. Uh, just trying to come in here and get my workouts done has left the sweeping to a minimum and it was gross in here. So, thought I'd start off with that because you know, content. Coming in today with a quick review of this. The Matrix Lid is we're taking a look at this this lid right here. Not the whole cup, just the lid. So what this thing is, is it's actually a, a lid that fits on top of pretty much any stainless steel tumbler. Now, this is a 20 ounce tumbler. Matrix Lid sent me this. They sent me this package so that I could use it, test it, review it, and show you guys kind of what they're all about. Now, this tumbler, as you guys can see, it, there's nothing special about it other than the fact that it's a really nice orange and it has their logo on it Other than that. This is this is just like every single 20 ounce stainless steel tumbler That exists. There's there's really nothing special about it and with how many tumblers are on the market these days This isn't gonna be like a, a Yeti review back in the day when when Arctic was coming in and Ozark Trail and people were doing ice tests on YouTube. I watched a ton of those, I bet you you did too. But I'm not gonna do that because everybody has a cup like this now. In some form, most people have 20 ounce cups. Um, I know when I was doing some research for this, I went through and I counted, including this one, I have 10, 10 20 ounce, not no other size, 10 20 ounce stainless steel tumblers. That's a lot. And out of those 10, I have spent money on one of them. One. I think about three or four were gifts for birthday, Christmas, uh, some a holiday between Jen and myself. And the rest were just like company giveaways. Cups like this are pretty much go-to giveaways. Uh, really good gifts, in my opinion. I, I, I use, we use these, we have 10, and we use every single one of them uh, on ro a rotation. They're great cups, They're, it's a great size, you can fit it in any cup holder. The problem with these cups though, is you have so many of them, but there's really little to no use when it comes to fitness and taking them to the gym. Um, now you could, of course, these hold liquids, you can bring anything you want in them to the gym and use it to drink out of, that's, that's fine. Uh, but that's about as far as they go. They're good for water, they're good for coffee, pretty much any pre-mixed liquid. F emphasis on the pre-mixed. Um, these aren't really good to blend protein shakes in. Uh, I've tried. <laughs> I, I thought, hey, maybe I can just use my tumbler and I'll shake up a protein shake. It didn't really work out very well. Uh, and not only that, but putting a blender ball in this thing is incredibly loud. It sucks. I know blender ball or blender bottles makes a stainless steel tumbler with their blender ball inside and it's horrible. I, I can't stand that sound whatsoever. I can't even stand that sound in a plastic bottle, let alone stainless steel. And then you've got a company like Ice Shaker, which I've reviewed here on the channel. I'll leave that linked up. It is a great bottle. Don't get me wrong. I love it. But I there was just it wasn't great for everything. And it, it was honestly really good. I love that bottle. I really do. But for those of you that don't already have one, it's another stainless steel tumbler to purchase that is primarily a shaker bottle. And yes, they have coffee lids for it now and it does hold coffee. That was always my biggest gripe though. Drinking coffee out of it wasn't great. Um, but again, for those of you that don't have one, you might not wanna drop $20, $30 on another shaker bottle just so you can get the insulated properties out of it. That is where the matrix lid comes into play. This little lid is $10. It is just a nice small lid. Again, $10. And what you do is you can take your 20 ounce shaker bottle, something you probably already have at least one of, you put it on top and now you've got a shaker bottle. It's genius. And I'm, I'm dead serious, you guys. This thing, I thought, I, I reached out to this company after I saw an ad on Instagram saying, hey, send it over, I wanna, I wanna review this. They, they agreed to it. Um, and I got it in and I thought at first, 
I don't know about this. You know, the it's got this like mesh on the bottom. Um, I wasn't sure how well it was gonna shake up. I thought the biggest problem was gonna be that it's really just a seal, just like just like any other any other 20 ounce bottle. And I run into problems where it leaks around this gasket all the time. So I thought shaking it up was gonna be a big problem, but I was I couldn't be more wrong. This lid, they made this so precise that one, it's extremely difficult to put on because it makes a spill proof seal. I'm, I'm serious, you guys, fill this thing up with water, you put this lid on, it's not spilling. You can shake it up as hard as you can, it's not gonna spill. Your shake is going to stay inside of this bottle. And I might even be able to show you guys, I have this completely locked down. If I push it down, oh my gosh, it's really hard to push down because of how tight it is. And you might not be able to see it on camera there, but it is starting to lift up around it just because of all the air inside. And when I open it up, you hear that? That's crazy. There is so much pressure built up in this that the cap pops right off. So there's no screw, there's no twisting screw, there's nothing else to attach to your bottle. You can use any 20 ounce tumbler. I tested it with all of mine. Every single one fit this lid. And apparently Arctic has a little bit of a different lid style. Uh, they sent me another gasket in case there was some wider brim cups that I had. I never ran into that problem. This fit every single one with no problem at all. Again, you have to keep it open when you place it down on the cup because it builds so much pressure. This seals so, so tightly that it, it's not gonna work if you, if you don't have a vent open. So the way this thing works is you actually have a removable, just kind of have to push it, a removable mesh right here that kind of clicks right onto the bottom of this, this lid. And you just put it on there and just ever so slightly turn it to fit into little grooves. I'm not sure if you can see that on camera, but you lock it in and this is all that mixes your drink. I have mixed up a lot of shakes in this thing uh, since I've had it and every one has come out perfectly mixed. I'm not kidding, I have no idea how, I, I am shocked at how well this pattern is working because I 100% expected it to just do okay. I expect it to be an okay option for a shaker lid to go on 20 ounce tumblers. Um, I didn't expect a lot, uh, but I was shocked. This mix is better than most of my blender bottles. This mix is better than the ice shaker agitator. And it is just this little honeycomb hive pattern that barely twists on to the lid. So you take it off, you clean it, and that's all there is to it. It's an incredibly simple design, and I am a huge fan of simplicity. The simple, the less moving parts, the better. And to that point, the simple design, take a look at the inside here. It's flat, it's smooth, there's no ridges, there's no handle, there's no extrusions. Uh, if you remember when I reviewed the ice shaker bottle lid, one of the things that I, I mentioned is there's a lot of like bumps in that lid and it made it a little bit difficult to clean because there's a lot of gaps where gunk can build up and I had protein powder just like encrusted in that lid. I've never had that problem with this lid because it's so smooth. There's no crevice in this lid. Um, and drinking coffee with this lid is great. Again, the ice shaker bottle, I'm making a lot of comparisons to it because it's the other stainless steel insulated shaker bottle that I own. Uh, it felt like all the steam trapped itself in the lid. So whenever I drank out of it, I was drinking steam and I wasn't a huge fan of that. But for, with this one, because it's so flat and because on the inside it's so smooth, you don't run into that problem. It's really just like drinking a regular coffee cup and then you can mix a protein shake in it later. It's, guys, I'm telling you, this is such a simple, simple little piece. For $10, to attach it to all of your 20 ounce tumblers. You know, obviously Matrix Lid sells their own tumblers. Um, it comes just like this. They don't actually have the coffee lid for the tumbler. But if you own a bunch of these, which I think, I think there's a lot of people out there that own a lot of these cups. I think this is a nice option. I, it's the same price as any other Yeti replacement lid or any other company sells their replacement lid. They're all about $10.
You pick up one of these and now you can turn your tumbler into a shaker bottle. I'm impressed. I, I legitimately am. Um, because I'm not on the go a lot. I have a home gym. I work out, you know, my house is right there. I don't have to commute to my gym. I'm right here the whole time. So something like this where I can just pop a lid on and come out to the gym or pop a lid on when I'm done or just use this bottle all day long sitting around the house, this works for me. This works, this is a great option for me. I think it would work out really well for a lot of people as well. Um, if you already have a million blender bottles laying around your house and you're not in the market for a new blender bottle, fine. But if you're looking for something that allows you to use these 20 ounce cups again, or get a little more versatility out of these 20 ounce cups, check out Matrix Lids. They're, it's solid, this thing's durable, it's not going anywhere. It makes these cups spill proof. Better than the Yeti lids, better than the stock lids they come with. You're not gonna spill anything out of this. You can drink water, coffee, protein, out of this lid, you can use it all day long on any of your cups and it's gonna work out phenomenally. So check the link down below, click on it, check out Matrix Lids, uh, not an affiliate link at all, just a neat company that I think you should check out. The only thing that I can really say isn't phenomenal about it um, is that there's no, nothing to hang on to on the lid. There's no loop, carry loop whatsoever. But that makes sense, right? Because there's no screw top, so you don't wanna like swing it around and run the risk of it popping off. It, it's gonna take some force to do that, but they're not gonna throw a carry lid on something that's just a friction fit, in my opinion. But that's the one thing that I, I saw as a negative, uh, because on every other blender bottle I have, there's some sort of carry loop on it. Um, super, super minor complaint, but I just thought I'd throw it in there. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you did, hit that like button. Helps me out in this channel. Uh, and I'm really trying to grow something here, so make sure you just smash that like button. Uh, also, if you wanna see the videos that I've got coming up in the future, make sure you're subscribed to my channel. And if you want to, hit that bell icon so that way you know when the videos drop. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Remember, in everything that we do, we are all in progress. Have a great day.